peace. So this is another impromptu video and I consider you all family. I think we're family, right? Shine your light family. So I was having a, um, a moment of um, self-reflective um, balance and I thought that I should perhaps share it with you all as well in the event that you all will benefit from it too. So I brought the idea of us being family because I am, you know, dressed in casual wear. I do have my hair tied up for the night. Um, however, I think I look presentable enough and us being family to um, briefly um, come on and share this video with you all. Um, I have one of my shiny light candles burning. I have um, incense burning and I have this. Can y'all see this? This is a singing bowl. And it was a gift um, that I received that made me very, very happy because I wanted a singing bowl, especially a crystal um, singing bowl um, so that I could do, um, I don't necessarily want to say meditation, however, for lack of better expression, meditation and focus on the heart chakra um, this is uh, a singing bowl for the heart chakra, and this is the sticker that came with it. It's going to be in the key of F, F key, F note, and it's for the heart green. I have the the um, LED lights um, on for ambiance um, with the candle burning, and um, I have incense burning. I have chakra incense burning, um, and I have the heart chakra the heart chakra burning as well. So I'm obviously learning how to play the singing bowl. Um, this would be like my maybe second time because I kind of did it a little bit when I um, first opened it up. Um, however, hopefully um, you all can resonate with the vibration of it. The tone can help like clear any energy or any blockages that you may have in your heart chakra or we may have in our heart chakra. I encourage you to envision uh, your heart chakra while you're listening um, to the tones. Um, our heart chakra is green. It is right here. You can envision um, the heart chakra being like a spinning um, um, ball of energy. And you can either do it clockwise like this, you know, or clockwise like this. Um, whatever resonates best with you and envision clearing it out, cleansing it, releasing anything that no longer serves you and envision it being balanced. So let me back up a little bit. So you can do a visualization of yourself being grounded on the earth, your feet being grounded, or maybe you're laying it on your back in, in your bed or you're in your favorite chair and you are grounding to the earth. And there are roots coming from either your back or your feet. And they're going all the way to the core, the center of the earth. And they're like plugged in. Like they're like secure in this place. And then you envision your heart chakra. And you envision letting go of any hurt, any pain, any old vibrations, anything that feels heavy. You know, if you felt slighted, if you felt you were done wrong, if you're um, going through a heartbreak um, or a bad breakup or even a, a amical breakup and you want to just let all of that energy just flow from you, just let it all go and it's going to go down, down, down through your lower uh, extremities, all the way down to your feet, all the way through the roots and they're going to go all the way down to the center of the earth and we're going to ask Mother Earth, if she will transmute this energy into positive energy and then disperse it to all or wherever it would be most beneficial. Once you complete that, then you envision being filled back up. So it's like you emptied all your water out of your glass and you've cleaned your glass up and now you're gonna fill your glass with refreshing, clean and pure water. So now you're gonna envision this green energy or whatever color energy resonates with you. However, because the chakra is green, I'm saying green energy, okay? Green energy filling up from the bottom to the middle, all the way up to the top, right? 
and then you want to make sure that it's spinning it's in motion it's in motion okay and then whenever you're complete you can bring the roots back up um, you can marinate in that vibration for a while. You can do whatever resonates with you to bring peace and a period to that idea. Make sure you affirm love for yourself. Forgive yourself. Let, be sure that you are confirmed and definite in letting go of anything that no, any and everything that no longer serves you for your higher, um, higher path and purpose. And um, welcome love. You know, ask the universe, ask the creator, ask the ancestors, ask the higher life forms, whichever resonate with you to impart or bring in or you're inviting in or asking for love to be brought in into your heart chakra. Starting with love for self, love for your brother, love for your sister, love for life, period, all throughout creation. Um, and then from there, whatever way you... you Feel best to end it or resonates best with you to end it. I like to um, verify that my aura is clear and it's, it's, it's protective, like it's strengthened. So like I'll envision a bubble around myself and be sure that that bubble um, doesn't have any cracks, any leaks. It's, it's secure. And then, um, you know, I open my eyes and I'm complete and I, you know, thank the creator. I thank the universe. I thank the unseen beings for um, all of what they assisted. And I thank myself for showing love and taking care of myself spiritually um, so that I can benefit in, in, in the physical, in the mental, the emotional, and then I can then um, operate more in my path and purpose. So I'm going to go ahead and start. Um, with that being said, keep those ideas in mind. However, again, you know, whatever resonates with you, that is what you do. It's nothing, no set in stone way. This is a recommendation for those that may not necessarily be um, well versed in this, this idea. So here we go. We're going to get started. Thank you. 
beautiful. Woofly. You all experience the vibration of that, the clearing effect. Um, I don't know if you all's heart feels like energized, like, like it's a lot of energy um, in my heart chakra area now. Um, again, like I said, I'm, I'm new to learning how to play these. So forgive me for, you know, any errors or any breaks. Um, I'm going to do it one more time. Um, just to be sure that, you know, you receive the most um, from it. And I will look to do this more often as I get better and come up with a whole, like, um, system to doing it um, so that we all can benefit in receiving the balance um, that's available together. So I'm going to do it one more time, and then we will conclude for tonight. Be free to leave any comments below, your thoughts, your experiences. I would love to hear about them. If you're familiar with singing bowls, you have any recommendations, be free to leave them in the comments below as well. Like the video, that would be greatly appreciated. Thumbs up the video, that would be greatly appreciated. Um, if you haven't already, subscribe to the channel. Um, share, 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 share. That will also be greatly appreciated. However, um, I will that that was beneficial. I will that it assisted you. And I thank you. And I appreciate you being here with me and us sharing in this moment together. Until the next time, family, shine your light. Love and peace.